coming here from Donkey Camping. This is what this campsite is called now. The sun has just come up over the top of the mountain here. And that's where we're heading today. If we make it today, it's going to be our highest ever climb from 3,700 meters to 4,700 meters. This has been a great night here. And uh, I'm going to pack the tent away now and uh, head on up the mountain. Oh, you know, leaving donkey camping as we've called it. Had some, met some great people there from Texas and Argentina. So uh, they've helped us with uh, charging our battery. Otherwise we'd have no film today. So, okay, let's get on the road. Okay, today the adventure continues. The climb continues. Today we're taking on our highest ever mountain pass. 4,700 meters. Not sure if it's possible, but we'll see how it goes. Okay, now at 4,000 meters. It's extremely steep now, this uh, section here. It's difficult just to keep the bike moving. But uh, we're climbing very quickly now. 4,000 now. What did we start on? 3,850? 3,700. Uh. 4,000, Jamie. Think it's easy? Oh, my goodness. getting thin now oh okay this is gonna be tough this is gonna be tough oh let's see how far we can get and Jamie rides by without even panting or the slightest sign of his being out of breath that's a bit strange but he also is born at 4,000 meters in altitude so maybe his body is better adapted to this a series of about 10 hairpin bends as we make our way up the mountain. Some way we're going to get up here. I've seen pictures of this road now, it looks absolutely incredible when we get to the top and you see all these uh, hairpin bends switchbacks that we're now going to ride off to 4,400 meters now, just above that now. This is the highest we've ever been and certainly the hardest mountain we've ever climbed. Another 400 meters to go. Oh, let's see if it's possible. This is going to be the challenge oh, of the trip. Oh. So we made it to 4,400 meters. This is the place for lunch. This is the hardest mountain we have climbed yet. And I have broken my what's called down record and biked it 3.5 kilometers an hour as the snow that we have the reason for that is this, that's the road. And that's where we started from. And there we have the mighty Waskaran mountain that's been towering above us now for a few days and now we're nearly in line with the snow there. few hundred meters now is insane. <sighs> Completely gasping for air and out of breath having to push the bikes now. Oh. It's gonna be hard now to get over the top. <sighs> the 
This is the road, we just cycled up. Difficult to believe ourselves. There's the mighty Waskaran. One hundred meters from the top now. Fifty more meters to go. Oh, it's done. Family from Texas here uh, on a very very long tour here, ten month tour in South America with their family. Their two young girls. They actually stopped earlier and uh, gave us some water. It's just we ran out of water. That was a great help. And uh, it's come past us now. They're going up to the top. Maybe we'll see them up there again. Okay, the summit is within sight. And that's what we just conquered. See what's on the other side. Oh, oh. So now we have a one thousand meter descent. They don't seem uh, so steep, or they're not as steep as the roads that came on the other side. So, an easy way to get up is to come up from this way and then down into Yungay. But the scenery is amazing. So, another 8.3 kilometers downhill. We're still at 4,100 meters here. We're going back down to 3,700. And there should be a guest house. We're just hoping now that they have room for us for three tired. Cyclists. Yeah, we made it down the mountain. We're pretty cold. Our hands are freezing cold. It's a thousand meter descent. We turned up here. Hilara Cafe. It's a pretty cold place. Luckily they have a room. We can stay there. Oh, it's great. And a really, really cozy kitchen in here. Oh, this is good. Now we run out of food. So, we actually had a room here, but that we didn't book. And uh, just given us Inca or coca tea yeah. in the kitchen and then we can stay here oh this is what we were dreaming of coming down that mountain we can stay in here oh. there's even a hot shower ah oh, that's more than one of they just go to even make us dinner so oh life cannot that's be more, better more than four, than what we hope for. i can't even believe we can have a hot shower it's just excellent. When, when you're out in like the nature and you the wind and the cold and when when you somehow then everything just keep Everything just 
Works out. Your way works out and you get heavy for what you get yeah. for mm. that day. So yeah, I'm very grateful really. that we could find a place yeah. to stay. That's yeah. the great thing about bike touring, you never know what the day will bring. Yeah. yeah. Excellent. So okay. you're more large. Perfect. Yeah. Okay, let's, let's go in the shower. Yeah, let's go let's and get that. some. Three hours ago, we were coming down the mountain, not having any idea if we could find a place to stay or if they would have space for us here. But wow, what a just what we needed. We're sitting in their kitchen there, and they've cooked us a what a three course dinner with yeah. soup and oh, amazing. And, and uh, we had a hot shower as well. Yeah, that was amazing. Yeah. So that's yeah. the hardest day we've had so far on a bike, but yeah. got some reward for it here. Yeah. So. That was that's something that you you make. Uh, you get happy and after a long day of cycling hard then you are happy for what you get yeah. and uh, just the small things are seems big things yeah, yeah. exactly yeah. exactly yeah. so yeah we never know what to expect but this yeah. was great yeah. well just what we needed mm -hmm. after what the hardest day we ever had on our bikes even i was puffing and panting today <laughs> <laughs> and that's not really often that happens i haven't seen andrew before hanging over the handlebars but he was today yeah first time ever <laughs> but uh, yeah that's a big challenge we've never been up so high before but we did it yeah then we need to go to bed yeah yes. we need that. some sleep good night yeah. from here